All right, lick number 22 is more of a funky style strum. Again, very Steve Ray Vaughan-esque. So let me play this for you and break this down. Okay, so what's happening there is I'm playing 10 on the fifth string, 12 on the fifth string with my first and third fingers, and then I'm going to the 10 on the fourth string. Okay, then I'm going back to the 12 on the fifth string with my third finger, and then I'm going back to the 10 on the fifth string twice, and then I'm ending with the 12, which is an A again. So the first thing to do is just to get that little pattern down. So 10, 12, 10 on the next string, back to the 12, and then 10, 10, 12. Now, the funky rhythm aspect of it is it's like you're strumming a guitar chord. And what you're doing is you're deadening out all the strings that you don't want, but you are still strumming everybody. So, for instance, when I go for this 10th fret of the 5th string, I'm killing all the strings or deadening all the other strings with this finger. I'm, I'm deadening out the 6th string with the tip of my index finger, and I'm deadening out the 1st, 2nd, 3rd, and 4th strings with the rest of my index finger. And then when I go here, I'm still deadening with this finger. It's when I go here to the 10th fret of the 4th string, now again, I'm deadening the 5th the string with the tip of my index finger and the ones down here with my 1st finger. The problem is the 6th string. So when I go to hit that one, I'm just staying away from the 6th string. So when I go... I'm staying down, I'm trying to stay away from that. Now if I need to, I could use my middle finger, for instance, to touch that string and kill the 6th string that way too, and that would be okay. So the, the real difficult part of this lick is trying to get comfortable with keeping your rhythm going, you know, not tightening up like that, but actually letting loose. Kind of create that sort of Stevie Ray Vaughan-ish kind of, of rhythm technique. 